On Drop Rate is a series all about testing my luck. Each episode I will pick one or multiple activities to do and one specific unique to get from those activities. But there is a twist. I am only able to do this activity until I am exactly on Drop Rate. Kill 5000 Listen Men Shamans to get a Dragon Warhammer. Defeat 512 Venonares to achieve a Treasonous Ring or loot 300 Rifts to obtain an Abyssal Needle are all ideas going by this rule. To spice it up even further, if I manage to get the item within the limited attempts, I get to keep everything I earned including the unique item. If I do not get it however, I have to forfeit half of all the money I earned during the grind to one of you guys, the viewers. But now, let's get into the video. What is going on guys and welcome to another episode of the on drop rate series in the last one we went for the guardians of the rift to get the abyssal needle which we did not end up getting unfortunately but in this one maybe we will get luckier and get the item we're hunting for we are going to go for the bryophyta essence from bryophyta which means we are doing 118 kills and to actually be able to do Bryophyta you need a mossy key and you get that from the moss giants. You can kill them in various different places in the world. So let's get into that. Now before we get into the video we have a giveaway to do for 4.55 million and we have 227 entries so let's see who the winner is going to be. It is going to be Alex Fielding Axley323 and he says I'd like to see you do a pet drop rate. So congratulations to you for 4.55 million win. The account he signed up with is a group Iron Man, but he did have a main account he could accept the money on, so that is all fine by me. So here you go, you can read the chat by the way if you want to have it confirmed that this is the right person. Nothing, 1224. Congrats to you, Axley323, for the 4.5 million giveaway. So let's briefly talk about how I'm going to be getting the mossy keys. I'm going to be killing them in the wilderness right here at this location and the drop rate of the keys if you're on a slayer task, which I'm not going to be, but that is 1 in 50. And if you're not on a slayer task, it's 1 in 60. But there are other locations in the game where they are 1 in 150 of slayer task and I, I would assume 1 in 50 if you're on a slayer task. But there is also the Iowerth dungeon in the Priftinus area, which is 1 in 120 or 1 in 40 on a slayer task. So there's a variety of different ones, but for no slayer task, this is the most consistently best one. So I'll just go for 100 keys, use them all, see how many I get from the boss, and if I'm still missing a couple for the 118, I'll just come back and get those as well. It has now roughly been one and a half to two days almost of AFKing Moss Giants, and I do not have all the keys yet, but I have a good amount, I have 81 keys, so we're still going to get 19 more, but I did want to talk about two things. I'm getting a lot of long bones from this, I don't think I've got 32, I think I've got maybe like 20, which is still a very good amount, that is a good amount of construction experience, I don't remember exactly how much, but it's pretty nice. But the big thing is, look at these, 51 Raynar seeds, I'm going to price check it, they are ridiculously expensive right now, 62,000 per one. That's because probably Raids uh, 3 is coming out and a lot of people want the prey potions. Just from the Moss Giants, I've gained the 3.2 million almost. And of course, I'm going to include this in the giveaway if I do not get the Bryophyta Essence. So it's going to be something that is going to help quite a bit to bump up the price of the overall price check at the end. And that is the last one for 100 mossy keys and I was actually kind of lucky I got it before 6000 kills which would be on drop rate. All the loot is on the screen right now. Also it says 85 keys but some of them just didn't get tracked for some reason. So let's go ahead and put it into the bank to see the nice 100 stack of mossy keys. As I said I probably will have to go back. I just wanted to make sure I don't get really lucky with the key drops and I have to like go over 118. But I'm going to start with 20 keys at a time. And let's actually gear up and see what I'm going to be using for this boss. So this is the gear I've decided to pick and I am going to go with a full range setup with a blowpipe. The boss has pretty low HP and it also spawns minions that has like 5 HP. So I think a blowpipe is very good to get it down very fast, the minions and the boss itself. And I'm going to be bringing a dragon axe as well of course for the minions. It doesn't really matter if it's a dragon, if it's bronze, that is irrelevant. But one small trick I want to show you guys is that if you have menu entry swapper, you can actually configure your left click and I'm going to do that for use. And then I guess save left click. So now my left click is use. So when the minions spawn, I can just click on this and click on the minions. I don't have to use it like that. So that's very convenient. And I'm bringing 20 keys, as I said before. And I think I might have to adjust that. I don't know how much inventory space I'll have. 
So let's have a look at the actual boss itself. It is a very, very easy boss. It's a free to play boss even. It's like the end game boss for free to play, I guess. And as you can see, my weapon is just destroying the boss and it's looking like I'm not even going to get the minions this time. But uh, sometimes I will and the blowpipe is really good for those. But uh, let's see what the first loot is going to be. That was like a 10 second kill or something. Nature runes and a combat achievement as well. By the way, this boss drops beginner clues every single time, but I am actually this time not going to do them because if I would do all 118 and I would not get the Bryophyta Essence, the entire chunk of all the beginner clues on average would be worth like uh, 500k. And it would be like two hours added onto the grind, just running back, and probably more than that, just doing the beginner clues. Oh, this time we actually got the minions, so let's have a look at this. I just attack them once every single time, and then I use the axe on them one by one, and uh, I misclick, and there we go. Very, very smooth and easy. Would you look at that? I got nothing, I think, for this drop. It dropped the Marantil seed, but it didn't say anything in the chat. It's 5 GP for that kill. What a beautiful drop. You might have noticed that my kill count is actually at 10 now, even though I've only done 3 kills. I did actually have 7 already when I started this grind, meaning that the end kill count, if I do not get the Bryophyta Essence, is going to be 125 for 118 kills in this video. There it is, the first mossy key drop of the grind, the 1 in 16 chance, as I said, I will hopefully get quite a bit of these, so I don't have to go back for too long to the moss giant in the future. But yeah, very nice to see one early in the grind. Very shortly after that, the first milestone kill count, 10 kill count after this one. And the loot is of course not incredible, but uh, at least it is something. I'm definitely going to be making more money off of the actual moss giants than Bryophyta herself. But uh, of course that can change if I do get the Bryophyta essence. But I have to say, I will definitely have to change my inventory. Look at the food, I'm not even using any of the food at all. So I think I'm just going to bring like two anglers or something like that, maybe even zero food. I will have to try out some different things, but I think the blowpipe healing and just praying magic sitting on ranged means I'm going to be taking zero damage during this entire grind. So I think that's what I'm going to be doing. Here it is, the evolved inventory, two ranged pots or divine ranging potions, some prayer potions and two anglers just in case. And this time I'm bringing 30 keys. I did not forget anti-poisons, I am not poisoned at all, that is not true. Your eyes are deceiving you. Nature runes, nice drop. I, I will not have to go back to the bank. No. What? G <laughs> Grimy Guam Leaf. What an absolute Chad drop right there, that is some giga Chad loot. And on that kill, number 66 overall for the account, but on 59 for this video, we have reached the halfway point to the 118 kills for the drop rate of the Bryophyta Essence. We do not have it yet, but uh, the halfway point is the halfway point, we still have a decent chance of getting it. I want you guys to look at this clip. The minions spawn and when they do, the boss becomes immune, so you have to kill the minions. And I have no idea if this is complete RNG when they spawn or not. I attack the boss like one time, they spawn again. And sometimes I can kill the boss without them even spawning. And I could spend like a long time killing it, none of them spawn. And now I killed all of them with the axe. I attacked the boss and one more time, three times in a row. How is this a thing? <laughs> like what? It feels like it's just RNG, they just randomly spawn on attacks and there's a percentage chance and that time I was just really unlucky or something. But if you do know how it works, please let me know in the comments. Oh, there it is. Triple Adamant Kai Shield drop, that is 1 in 118 drop rate. The exact drop rate of the Bryophyta Essence, so that could have been the item. But you can always say that, I mean you can always say it could have been that, it could have been this. But it wasn't the Bryophyte Essence this time. Alright, we're down to the last key I have. This is including the 100 plus the 7 I got from the boss itself. Which is actually almost exactly... Okay, never mind, we're not ready just yet. And now I'm lucky, I was about to say I was exactly on drop rate almost for the keys. But now I am slightly above it, so we are going to end at 108. Unless of course I get another one on this one. That means I have to go and get 10 more keys after this one. And look at that, that is the last mossy key we need. We have all the 118 overall now we need for the last kills. 
Let's go ahead and finish the grind up. All right, we have three keys left to go. This is the third to last kill, and we get rune swords. Oh man, it is looking like I'm going to be losing the third challenge in a row. My last videos have not been great, but uh, two more keys, we still have a chance. One last key after this one left. Can we get the essence now on the second to last kill? Rune longsword? <laughs> not quite, not quite. It all comes down to this, the last key of the entire grind is going to give us two runeite bars. So yet again we lose the challenge. And overall KC is 125 and I actually really wanted to get this item because if you go to the collection log you would just straight up complete the entire log for Bryophyta if you got this essence. It's the only rare drop it has. So it's kind of a bummer that I did not get it on drop rate. So adding all the loot together from Bryophyta and all the moss giants I had to kill to get all the keys, the overall loot is worth 9.95 million. And I'm deciding right now in this moment if any value of a lost challenge is less than 10 million, I'm going to give away everything. So the giveaway for this video is 9.95 million. And how you win this challenge is on the screen right now with all the rules. So good luck to all of you. A massive thank you to both Edward Bobsled and Gustavo Bro for supporting the channel as members. You can do this if you want as well for only $3 a month by clicking the join button below and get a shout out for yourself as well. But I do hope you guys did enjoy this episode. I sure did enjoy making it. And until next time guys, take care.